what's up guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing absolutely fine and today i'm gonna talk about the ui ux design course that i'm doing and i'm gonna talk about what my experience is how i how do i find this course if you should do this course and what is basically ui ux is so this is what i'm gonna talk about in this video i'm gonna share my reviews on to uh, this course and if you are someone who was interested and want to know about ux design if you want to do a ux design course then what about this course that i'm doing right now so i'm gonna go share everything in this video and i hope this video will make a lot of sense and maybe you will eventually you will sign up for this course or maybe some other course in the ux design field so yeah before we waste any more time let's roll the intro and start this video four and five months ago i got to see this instagram post that i really like about ui design and i thought that i can create this in the pixel lab 2 and eventually i did it and after that i really like it the way it was designed and i really like it the process of creating a ui design and i started to search about ui design on youtube let's say then i got to know about ux design and the field is so big and i got to know that how what ux design is what people do into it and what is the current scope of the ux design in general so this is how i got to know about uh, you know ux design in general like i got to see ui design i like it that and then i got to know about ux design and what actually ux design is so this is the backstory of how did i got to know about ux design now the question is what is exactly ux design is if i read you out the definition the definition goes something like this ux design is the process of designing a digital product that people find useful and making their experience easy and enjoyable so ux design is basically a research a development research of the app or website or a digital product in this case they are talking about digital product which is basically a app or website and ux design is the process and research process actually and they will think about everything that user experiencing with the product if you are if they are using the product let me explain this in a short way so let's say if you are using a payment app let's say any payment and let's say payment uh paypal app so paypal app is a app that can transfer money from bank account so if you want to develop an app from scratch just like paypal then the research that will go into it like how the functions are going to look like where the scanner button is going to be where the where how people can use it and how the app is going to look and how the experience of the people who are using it be like the research behind it is actually ux design yeah it sounds a little uh, complex right now but basically it is the research that goes into a development of the app or website and making it easy as easy as possible for a large amount of people describing and considering the fact that they are not literate they may, they may be are using different languages let's say they are not speaking english sorry guys my memory card was full and i had to cut the video but uh, <laughs> uh, basically considering this whole topics like the whole fact and when you consider and develop the application or website that is what ux design is the process is called ux design so ux design is in trend right now because of the new people are coming online a lot of the people are getting internet connections a lot of the people or users are using multiple apps a lot of the brands are using applications their own applications or websites to promote their brands and that is just increasing day by day so that's why i think ux design is going to be in trend for the next couple of years and if you're doing ux design right now it is going to help you a lot in your career now let's talk about the course that i'm doing right now it is a ux design course from google hosted on coursera website which is a educational website like all the others and this is coming from google and the best part is all the teachers in this course are from google who are actually employees of the google Google in UX design and they are going to teach us every field in UX design. So this is the best part in the UX design that the teachers who are going to be explaining things into us into this video or into this uh, course, they are actually a Google employees in the UX design and they are going to explain us everything in this course. So this is a pre-recorded course which means you can do it at your own space. You can take your time you can do it on the weekends and just because it is pre-recorded you don't have to go live in the class you don't have to worry about timing issues and that is what makes it better now i'm going to be sharing with you how my experience is like while doing this course how the course is designed basically and how the course is better than let's say a live class so this is what i am going to give you a demo and this is going to be a pre-recorded video that i shot while i was doing the course itself and this is how the experience of the web design or the ux design looks like okay so i hope you will be able to see everything so this is uh, Coursera and this is what uh, this is how it looks like I am in the middle of course right now in the middle of like last phase or the fourth uh, you know fourth week like this is the fourth week that I'm doing right now I'm almost completing the 
first month of this UI UX design course. So right now, uh, as you, this is how it looks like. Right now, as you can see right here, if you can see it says video, it says four minutes. So I've done watching a four minute video. And after that, I got this, I got, got on this thing right here, which is says blue. So this is like selected. It says reading, it is for 10 minutes. And here you will get to see a lot of the text like this. So it is related to what they just said in the video, like in this video, they talked about, let's say, introducing the website. Now they are suggesting all of the more details that you can read about this website, like say Squarepace, Webflow, Wix. These are the website for, uh, you know, building your portfolio. And that is what I'm learning right now. Start your UX design portfolio, as you can see right here. So this is how they are uh, teaching everything like this whole month. This is the way it is going. You will get to see a lot of the things right here. They, they will like cover up topics right here. Then you will open up these things right here. Then I'm going to go read the second, the second thing right here like this. This is the plan your portfolio website. So this will be one reading after this one. If I complete this mark option, then I will go on to this option. This will be checked. Then I'm going to go on this one. Then I'm again, I'm going to go get a video. So I'm going to show a video as well. But uh, right now I have to read this one. And then after that, I am going to show you the video as well. But once I complete the video, I will have to uh, get go through a practice quiz. So this is how the quiz looks like. It was like maybe two or three questions middle while. So meanwhile, you'll be able to get to see quizzes that are coming up. Uh, they are asked about what you are what they're teaching right now in the currently phase so, so this is how it looks like and i'm going to show you a video as well if i come to this point uh, i will show you the video as well but this is how it has been going and again uh, you will be able to see this uh, hyperlinks so you can also use these hyperlinks there are hyperlinks everywhere so if they, have, they are teaching you about some website or some google thing that they are working on they will give you the website so you can also go and check out more about that and this has been happening throughout this whole month. So yeah, I am going to show you the video after this one. Yes. Let's see. In the tech world, user experience mostly focuses on how people use or interact with products. In this course, we'll explore the foundations of UX design and why it's so important for consumers and businesses. Now that you know how the course actually looks like in this six months, you're going to be learning two design softwares. The first one is uh, the Figma website and the another one is Adobe XD. You're going to be creating portfolio of yours in this course itself, which will help you, let's say, get a job. And also by the end of this course, you'll be getting a Google certificate, which will certify you as a UX designer. Let's say you have done a basic beginner level course. So that is the certificate that you're going to be getting at the end of this course. Now let's talk about the cost of the course. For the first month, I have paid 1000 rupees for one month which means for six months it is going to take me around six thousand rupees which is around hundred and hundred and twenty hundred and ten dollars in us and in general this course will cost you around hundred to two hundred dollars that's it so this is also a kind of a cheapest course that you can get for ux design and it is much cheaper than a dedicated boot camp that you can apply for UX design. You can also get a subscription for three months or you can also apply for the six month subscription and they will cost you differently. Finally, let's talk about my final thoughts on this course. So if you are a beginner, let's say you're a beginner and you don't know anything about UX design, then this is the best course that you can apply for. This is best for the people who are just starting and it is also going to help you get internship, let's say, and this is coming from a Google. So if you are a beginner and if you want to do something in UX design, this is the best course that I can suggest so far and I'm going to tie the next month of the subscription for this course. And this is the video guys. I hope you like it this video and this helps you on your UX design journey. If you got any more questions, you can comment me down below and all the links that you need are in the description below. If you want to see more videos like this, then definitely subscribe to this channel right now. And if you like it this video, then hit that like button right now as well. I'm going to catch you guys in my next video. Till then, keep on creating great graphic design work. Oh, 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 oh,